if you come to Jesus with a serious heart and you ask Him to accept you as a child of God, then He immediately accepts you without any conditions. He will not look at your past, where you come from, what you've done. He will accept you, forgive you, and give you a fresh start. He will make you new. He will make you a child of God with all the benefits of a child of God. He will immediately set you free from the power of sin and addiction. I have seen a man as drunk as a skunk become sober in a moment when he accepted Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ makes you free from the power of sin the moment that he accepts you. Those whom the Son of God have set free will be free and free indeed immediately when I come to him. But most believers go back to sin. They go back to bondage. Then they themselves have turned away from Jesus. They despised the freedom that he gave them. And then they do not get free again. If we despise the freedom that he gave us, then he allows us to go into the bondage that we love. And that is why most believers can not stop sinning. They went back to sin. They went back to bondage because they loved sin and they despised the freedom that Jesus gave them. If you want to stay free, you have to stay with Jesus Christ. That is the only place where you have freedom. But if you have turned away from Him, and you have fallen into sin, and you have become entangled, bound again in the bondage of sin and addictions, then you have to make up your mind and be serious with Jesus Christ. You will have to fight the battle, and you will have to reject that sin. You will have to fight against the devil that you invited back into your life. You have to take sides with Jesus Christ. Go back to Him. He will accept you, but you will have to fight off the devil in the name of Jesus Christ. Repent of your sin. Turn away from your sin. Hate it. Hate Satan. Hate your bondage. Love Jesus. And then reject that sin and that bondage in the name of Jesus Christ. Submit yourself to Jesus. Resist the devil and he will flee from you. But you will have to fight with every bit of power that is in you until you have no more power. And then Jesus will give you the power to reject the devil, to overcome that sin. But you have to be serious. You have to give it everything that you have. And then Jesus will help you. Then you must stay with Jesus. Do not despise the freedom that he gave you. Hate sin. Hate the devil. Hate your bondage. Love Jesus Christ and follow him with all your power. Stay with him. Resist the devil and he will flee from you. Stay away from sin. Stay with Jesus and you will stay free. If you go back to sin, you will perish. Because no sinners will go into the kingdom of heaven. May Jesus bless you.